Well, hey, good morning, guys. It's Viejo here, and we are starting the third week of December 2023. Got a chilly start here on the central coast of California. It's only about maybe 45 degrees outside. Still pretty early in the morning. I got 55 here in the garage at, what do we got, 48% humidity. So a little on the cool side in here, you know, but is what it is. Hey, I want to bring you up to date on a couple of things here. Um, one is the status of my knee. I was at the uh, orthopedist um, this Monday, I guess, yes, yeah, Friday. And they said, yeah, you're doing well, the bone's healing, and there's lots of new bone growth and stuff, but you've got another three weeks in that blankety-blank brace before you can do uh, anything. So it's light duty till then. Don't want you walking hard. Don't want you, you know, carrying stuff, any, any of that kind of nonsense. But anyway, doesn't really hurt anymore unless I do something stupid. But um, So it's going to be a while before I can get to the range and do any shooting. So I uh, fill in with some stuff. Um, I've still got a couple of moldy Mondays uh, in the can um, for the next two weeks or so. And then after that, we'll have to see what happens. But also uh, over on the Rumble channel, I'd been running a series that we were calling Free the Few, where I was taking uh, containers of cast bullets that I had that had less than 100 rounds left in it and getting them loaded up, taking the range and shot and, and um, getting those off the shelf before I do a whole bunch of more casting. Well, I'm out of that <laughs> material now. Not out of bullets, I'm just out of shooting video. So I'm going to uh, work on a couple of other things. Um, fortunately, um, I've had some help from some, some friends. Um, and uh, Gene, that's reloading from the hot pot, and his... Um, faithful companion, Ms. Hotshot, sent me some uh, prime brass for the new 41 mag, which I still have not fired yet, and it's driving me nuts, believe me. Um, so this brass uh, came to me um, prime, but that was it. So what I'm going to do is uh, do a short series with the, this 41 mag brass. I'm not going to do it all at once. Um, and so we'll get in and get the, the cases the rest of the way prepped, and then we'll choose a, a round and get some loaded. Now, all that said, I'm still on the radar here on, on YouTube, so I'm not going to do any reloading. And um, for those of you who aren't, aren't creators, what happens is that um, as soon as you commit a foul, <laughs> you get a warning the first time, then um, and you're, and that video gets deleted. And if you do it again, you get a strike. And with your first strike, you can't upload um, or, or do a number of other things on YouTube for a week. If you get a second strike within 90 days, um, you're out for two weeks, you get a third strike within 90 days and your channel is completely removed. And that's what happened to my previous channel. Well, once you get that warning, it stays in place. The strikes evaporate after 90 days, okay? And in theory, you could start all over again, but one foul video gets you another strike and then you can't, can't do anything for another week. Well, and so the strikes last for 90 days. The warning, though, lasts forever. That never evaporates. So you're always one step away from getting a channel strike. And um, if you've been kind of watching some of the other guys who do casting and reloading and stuff, they're being real careful about what they what they show on, on YouTube. So I'm treading on thin ice, and I know it. So I'm not going to show any reloading here. This is all going to go on, on Rumble, and I'm going to do a segment each Friday. Okay, probably three segments worth on this 41 brass. Okay, so if you want to see it, um, what's going on there, uh, go ahead and step over to the um, Rumble channel and maybe I can figure out a way to just kind of notify you here, maybe in the context of another video that I'm doing um, here on YouTube. And say, oh yeah, by the way, we got another issue of, of this. Best way, of course, just go subscribe over there on Rumble and you can get notifications just like you do on YouTube. But 
that's a, that's up to you guys. But anyway, we're going to get started on this, and by the time you see this video here on YouTube, you'll that one will be uh, uploaded over on the Rumble channel, so you can go check it out over there. And again, you just go to rumble.com and type in my channel name right there, and you'll find me there. Okay, beyond that, I wanted to show you one other thing here. This is that 41 mag. And if you recall, I was saying I wasn't real thrilled about the grips that came on that firearm. And I did find a set of um, Smith & Wesson handles or grips, okay, you know, the, what they call a football style here that I like better. I like that that football cutout for, for my thumb. It fits in there and it, and it actually works pretty well for me. This particular set did not fit very well. They did not appear to have been used, which was interesting. So I don't know what the difference is, but if you if you look right here, let me zoom in here. Okay, and you can see that the edge of this grip doesn't come all the way back to the back of the frame. As it is, I had to work quite a bit to get them to fit this well down this line and along the front. And I look at it, look at it, and I think, well, maybe I could could take this out a little bit more over here and move these back but if I do then uh, then this area down here is not going to fit well so I think I'm just going to leave that like it is the grips do look better I think anyway than the newer thinner ones that are a completely different style and finish we'll see once I get out and get to shooting this guy we'll see if I like these the way they are or not um, you know I would have preferred that this edge came back here to meet the edge of the frame just like the other ones on my uh, 27, uh, 29, and 25 do, but that is what it is. So with all of that said, um, hey, if you want, go over and check out the Rumble channel. Take a look at the first step that I'm going to do with these guys. But that's going to do it uh, for this particular video. I hope everybody has a good weekend. we got rain inbound for the weekend here, so I'll be doing some other stuff. i got a couple other surprises in store for you. Um, uh, probably Sunday for the first one. So keep an eye out. So from the Viejo bench, for now, that's all she wrote. <laughs>